I am sure once in a while all of us have lost a good night's sleep. Stay with me, I am going to share with you how important is it to rest properly. Hello travel lovers! For those of you who don't know me yet, my name is Anna Maria, a former flight attendant with a decade of flying experience. I've created this YouTube channel to help people like you all over the world in achieving your dreams and goals in becoming a flight attendant. On today's episode, I am going to share with you how important is it to have a good night rest. Sleep deprivation is an all too common example of a process that includes circadian disruption. Research suggests that you should go to bed around 10 pm. But I would focus more on having a consistent routine when I will fix myself a schedule at what time should I go to bed and what time I will wake up, considering the fact that I should have at least 7 to 8 hours of sleep each and every night. Night shift workers may also consider bright light therapy. Honestly speaking, it's highly recommended that adults will get 7 to 9 hours of sleep per night. Research has suggested the sleep debt is just accumulating over the time because it's almost impossible to close that gap within two weeks and night. You would need four days of proper sleep to make up for even one hour of sleep death because many people get less sleep than they should during weeknight. It all depends on how late and regular a person's sleep patterns are. For example, falling asleep at 4 am and waking up at noon will cause a person to miss on on a lot of daylight, especially in the winter. This sleeping pattern could be problematic for various reasons, including physical and emotional health. Once you fall asleep, you descend into a deep sleep within an hour you went to sleep. And progressively, you will experience shorter periods of deep sleep as the night wears on. During deep sleep, body functions like breathing, heart rate are also very slow and your muscles relax. Waking up from deep sleep may make you feel mentally foggy for up to an hour. Deep sleep offers specific physical and mental benefits. During deep sleep, your body releases growth hormones to help you repair muscles, bones and tissues. Deep sleep also promotes immune system functioning. Additionally, slow wave rest may be necessary for regulating glucose metabolism. There are a few things that are in your control to have a good night rest. For instance, you should exercise regularly. And by that, I'm not telling you to go and kill yourself at the gym, but at least have a good walk before you go to bed. Also, do not have any caffeine intake after 12 pm. You should ensure that you have a cold, calm, quiet, dark environment to have a good night's sleep. You can also create a relaxing routine to wind down the evening. Taking a warm bath an hour before you go to bed will help you relax. Do not forget to add at least a couple of essential oil drops of lavender. You might also consider changing your diet. Do not eat at least 3 hours before bedtime. What you eat and drink before bedtime impacts your sleep. And those who ate more fiber are luckier to sleep deeper. Something else that might help you go into a deep sleep is listening to relaxing music or counting backwards from 100 to 1. Lavender essential oil is a proven gentle way to fall into a fast and deep sleep. You can even get as creative as spraying in it into your room, on your pillow, or light a lavender candle. For any questions you might have regarding the lifestyle of a flight attendant or how to become a flight attendant, I created specially for you a monthly live event on my Facebook page. To be able to participate at my live event, make sure you do follow me so you don't miss the notification. I thank you so much for watching and if you did find this information useful, do let me know in the comments down below, subscribe to my YouTube channel and why not like it. Until next time we meet, let your wings